hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel so let's explore the almakata site together so they call this place the caves of shuhaib if you if you are a muslim or a christian you remember when they talked about prophet moses marrying one of the children of shuhaib and staying in a particular city for 10 years guys this is the city it is in albada in tabuk in saudi arabia if you ever visit saudi arabia please don't hesitate to check so this is the entrance of the place i really love the way they designed this is just the only building in the entire place this place just has pictures of the different sites and the things that are being done there so this is the entrance basically it's just a place filled with rocks and caves there is really nothing so exciting about the place aside climbing rocks and craves and all of that honestly i did not really find it such an exciting place to visit although it was just really good to visit a place that is in history you know look at me i was so dehydrated and tired climbing all of these rocks the caves and everything really really dehydrated me so this place is like a combination of different cities because this place is kind of in the middle. That's what they call it, the median. It's in the middle. So they, they put the remains of different cities together and they are not going to be touching it. I don't know. So they say they would not be touching it. It's going to remain an historical site for a very long time. Look at how the place looks like a house. I'm really so amazed at the level of creativity that must have gone into this in that age it's really really amazing so basically the the um what do i call this this stand that arabic is written on it was talking up it was just giving a description of the place telling us that this place dates back to the second millennium bc what what that was a very long time ago but honestly it was just fun looking around seeing the entire place and at the point, it was giving me room and parlor vibe because I was like, really? Some of the caves were had different rooms. Some of them had like three rooms. Some had like two rooms. Some had some was just like a single room. Look at this one I want to show you now. It's giving the vibe of room and parlor. Like, look at the parlor and the room is inside. <laughs> I really don't know. I just felt like you guys should see this. And so let me know what you think tell me one place you want me to visit in alibada you can use google to check out the historical sites in alibada so i took some of these pictures for you you can pause and read through them they are just describing the beautiful place in alibada and if you remember we visited makna some days ago so bye subscribe to my channel please